Yo, where's the voice? Oh my god, it's beautiful, man. That's an ultimate tomboy voice, man. Oh, it's beautiful. What a waifu, man. What a waifu. Oh, she's Petra? Oh my god. God damn it. She's Petra? She's my waifu from... Uh... Oh my god, that is my waifu. Is it the woman I married in uh, Fire Emblem? Two, one, and go. There's just in my Link shirt here, because I just washed Pokemon. Is that the panda girl? Is that the, the cool panda ninja girl? No, it's the older panda girl, I think, from the opening. Maybe it's the panda girl. Yeah. Little girl's crying. Yeah, she's trying to be all cute. Yeah, it's the older girl, right? Yeah. It's all adorable. It's all sad that the girls are in the wars. Yeah, it's very dark. Let me fix that, guys. Sorry about that. How about now? Yeah, what is Sean? I see you crying in the open right there, Sean. Yeah. Yeah. Mina, I believe in you. This is very dark. Don't leave us! One here, Sean! That sounds like the dark man. They were like, no, one here, Sean! Yeah, that's just gonna die or something. But now we see you in the open crying, right? So it's gonna be fine. It's still one of the waifus, man. But here we go, more of Arknights. Uh, so yeah, I'm excited, guys. I just wanna play Pokemon. I freaking like it so far, really, right? I have the C I haven't shown the C-book, yeah, it's a C-book, I haven't opened it yet. Um, you know, kind of reflective there. Um, yeah, here's the normal. They have the same auto, yeah. They have the same auto. But honestly, really addictive, really addictive so far. Um, oh, there. Yeah, I, I played it for about three hours and I was three, but I think that if interested. And, um, oh my god, it's my waifu. Uni waifus, baby. Uni waifus, Doberman, doggy waifu. Ah, uh, no, that's not my, uh, I'm more on, uh, <laughs> uni waifu. Um. I like the opening, yeah. It's kind of the slow building of opening, right? That's what I'm sitting in my Zelda shirt. This is one of my favorite shirts, yeah. <laughs> Seriously. I have a lot of anime and gaming, but this is one of my favorite. My Nintendo shirt here, you know. I am not Zelda, but I can see you princess. Come on, this is one of my favorite shirts. <laughs> Come on, the ultimate Nintendo waifu. Link, Link waifu. <laughs> I love this shirt, seriously. <laughs> it cracks me up, man. It cracks me up. It makes me, it makes it gives a smile on my face every time, right? Um, like, you know, when I worked, you know, I work in the game industry, right, you know, uh, mostly, right? So, you know, when I, when I go to a game company, everyone's playing Zelda, right? And I'm like, <laughs> everyone gets the reference because. At least when I was a kid, right? It was always like people uh, people called uh, Link uh, Zelda, right? Yeah, that's a reference, of course. When I grew up, people were always like, "Oh, that's Shuen? I think so. This is finally Amiya and Shuen. I think it's maybe it's Lava, right? But I think it's Shen or Lava with the mask. Yeah, they are do something. So I'm hoping now, right, for a revenge episode, right? Oh, here we go. Yeah, Tanku Waifu. And so on. I'm hoping for them to finally win, right? Oh yeah, so new waifus, because of course they've been losing every fight, right? So now I need them to come back now and be like, you know, be stronger, right? Yeah. I need them to come in there and be like, now it's our time to win, right? I need that, right? I need that. Seriously, right? Um... Yeah. So now you got her, she's sniper right, and you know. Hmm. The alarm is going, it's happening. We took more elite enemies. Yeah, they got this kind of like the dragon kind of the winkle layers, right? They look more hardcore than what they usually do. Yeah, definitely. I mean, again, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a pretty game strike, but I, I meant these are my stronger NPCs, like stronger enemies. These guys look like they are, kind of, I don't know, boy dragons, something. Oh, this is the Shuen, right? Dragon waifu, yeah. One of the top dragon ones, right? I'm guessing so, exactly. Okay, the voice is pretty, pretty tough voice actor. Yeah, who's the voice actor? I recognize it too. Very tomboyish, yeah. It's like, yeah, shut up, yeah. 
Interesting. Who's doing her voice? Yeah, Xuan Shan. She's got an elite dragon, right? She's like a Chinese dragon, right? Yeah, East, East Asian dragon. Xuan Taisho, yeah. Captain Xuan! Yeah, she's coming to my bleach fight saying, Taisho! <laughs> yeah, Captain Xuan! Xuan Shan, yeah, come on. She's a tough dragon chick. Yeah, Xuan Shan. Man, her voice actor is very familiar. I'm sitting here, guys, being like, who's her voice actor? It's like a very tomboyish, you know, masculine, manly. Yeah, feels very masculine, right? Feels quite, um, uh, yeah, very dark, very dark, grooming voice for a woman. So, who's doing her voice? Yeah. They're splitting up as one. Yeah, let's go, doctor. We're definitely gonna check later who is her voice actor, of course. Because right now I'm just being, you know me, I've been frustrated, I'm like, how oh, is the voice actor? You know who I am, I'm sitting here thinking about it now, I can't figure it out. Um. Okay, so yeah, four. This is the most. Well, yeah, the opening has to be in the limo, yeah, this has to be the limo from the opening. Yeah, now it's a very, like, civilized... There has to be the car we see them in the opening, right? Definitely. Or the ending, also. The ending, I mean. The ending, I mean. Yeah, the ending. Her and Hoshigima are in the car in the ending, right? Yeah. This is by far the most, how is it, civilized, yeah, skyscraper city. This is like a Beijing or something. This is like, yeah, major capital that we haven't seen before. Or I like her massive sword on the back there. Oh, this is cool though. It's like the Chinese dragon there on the, the... Oh, man. Who's this character? Who's this character? Yeah, like some kind of boss or something. Oh yeah, another wife, but who's that? Doctor. <laughs> but who is that character? I mean, I almost I don't know the males, right? Yeah, who's that like a... What is he? He got the antlers? I don't know what he is. It's a kind of... Is... Yeah, what is he? What, what, what kind of... What is... What, is, what animal is he? Well, this is like a cat, right? But yeah, <laughs> but what is he? Now is being like, God damn it. What is he? He's like a kind of like... It has to be something in Chinese. Yeah. I'm just like... Oh, indeed. He reminds me of the other dragon lady. Well, not dragon, but the woman was like a, a dragon... Yeah, with antlers. He's a, is he also some kind of like a Chinese dragon of sorts? Like seriously, you gotta leave a comment below guys and tell me <laughs> what he supposed to be. What is that guy? Is he like um Yeah Yeah and he got the pipe and so on, yeah it's I am trying to figure out I'm trying to figure out what, what kind of monster he is. But I think he's a dragon. He looks like he has he's a kind of dragon maybe he's some kind of like um oh what's it called? Nuve or something? Is he supposed to be like an something else? He is something like a hybrid. He's like a chimera. He's like a Chinese chimera dragon of sort. He's like a new or something. I'm stuck on I can't stop. Sorry, I can't stop thinking about it. I'm like, what is he? What is he? You must be crazy. What is he? Okay, I'll try to drop it. But what hell is he? What is he? What kind of animal is he? I think he's a dragon. I think he's a Chinese dragon. I know I have people, I have no, I know I have fans in China, guys. You gotta help me out there. Yeah, you got fans in China. You gotta help me out, guys. My, uh, my beloved Chinese subscribers, help me out there. I can't figure out what he is. Her voice is also very familiar, but, <laughs> but yeah, don't be crazy. Uh, anyway, okay, I drop it. I drop it. I drop it. <laughs> Go back to the latest report. <laughs> yeah. I think it's the same, uh, like the one of the other waifus. Yeah, it's the same as the one. 
think he's the... I love her voice though, seriously. I love Shen's, Shen's uh, voice. Yeah, she got that really, I thought it got totally cool. Just good, like, yeah, muscular tomboy voice. Yeah, you know, like tomboys, yeah. She got that, like, you know, angry, angry tomboy lady. Uh, great voice acting. Hmm. Okay, what's this? Oh, like I like it like it is the arch. It is the fight that had in the yeah the showing of the world. Hmm. Hmm. I feel like a div devil, right? You know, you're gonna tear off this guy? Maybe. He trusts 40? Maybe. Yeah, he's like, you wanna you wanna team up? <laughs> you're like, I, I don't know, man. I guess I guess we have no choice. He's like a powerful guy. Seems kind of evil. That's kind of how it comes off as. You're like, maybe, maybe, maybe not. Yeah. Beggars can't be sushes, right? Yeah, I mean, yeah, it was really sad there. Thinking about her failure, I guess, last episode. Lungman. Yeah, it's like definitely based on like Hong Kong or something. Yeah, this city is massive, right? It's supposed to be probably Hong Kong, right? They kind of go into like an island or south of the China mainland. Something like that. I think, yeah. I said earlier, Shanghai, maybe. Yeah, I think it's like Hong Kong, right? That the country, it's in that area of... Um, But I guess he's supposed to be this kind of like, you know, try it something, yeah. He's like teaming up, yeah, something like that. <laughs> I'm also thinking guessing, honestly, right? Because being an enemy only in a pretty game, but I'm like, I guess it's supposed to be that kind of typical, yeah, like, uh, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. maybe it's based on Kovland then. Maybe it's based on Kovland. Is it called Kovland? Man, I'm, just, I'm hoping I'm saying the right name now. I'm gonna Google it immediately as I say the wrong name here, but it's called Kovland City. Kovla, yeah, Kovlon, Kovlon, yeah, yeah, the wall city. Is, is that what it's based on? Kovlon. So you used to be part of, uh, uh, yeah, Hong Kong, exactly. Uh, Kovlon, Kovlon, maybe I'm crossing it wrong, but yeah, you know, you, you know what, I mean, if you're Chinese, you know what I'm talking about. If you're Chinese, Mandarin, you know what I'm talking about, yeah. If you're from Hong Kong, you know, Cantonese. My, my Cantonese or my Mandarin isn't very good, but you, you know what I'm talking about. It, it is, um... You got that like Kovlon Hong Kong feel to it, right? The Wall City. It's like illegal quarter that they had in Hong Kong, right? Uh, I obviously grew up playing Shenmue, so I learned about that. <laughs> yeah. It's like Shenmue 2, baby. Playing Shenmue is how I learned about uh, Chinese history. <laughs> no, but that, that's actually why. When the first time I heard about it, they have a similar thing in Yakuza Like a Dragon, right? Also a similar reference to it. Yeah. Turn into history lesson, David. They want that, that, that reaction. <laughs> But it was a character, it really reminds me of this, um, you know, Kovlon uh, triad thing. Hmm. I mean, respects her though, I guess, that's kind of how she trusts him, I guess. Yeah, I guess obviously, like, but she's my mentor, so I respect, I, I trust her, that's why I trust him. Yeah, it's like my sensei, right? I think so, right? I think it comes from her being like, well, she's like my role model or whatever, my sensei, right, my trainer, so I can, yeah, if she, if she believes, I believe, right? 
Hmm. Probably. See, I feel I'm very right on this Kovlon. Uh, Kov yeah, I'm, I feel I'm very right on this Kovlon Hong Kong references. I, I want to go. Uh, you have to tell me, guys, if you're if you're if you're Chinese or if you're. Um, uh, then it's whatever, yeah, I mean, I know it's different, uh, I, I almost, I mean, generalizing, I know it's like, you know, Han, and I, I know my, I'm very into history, you know, if you haven't figured it out, you know, I, my, my grandfather had a, my grandfather was a history professor, a math professor, you know, I'm very into the history, I grew up with, you know, learning about history, but anyway, yeah, this again feels like Kovlon, right, this is like, Illegal. <laughs> the doctor is like, that's right, I took a rocket, the guy. The doctor is ready to fight, man. Daru! It's every anime, it's like, Daru! <laughs> it's the most anime thing ever, like, Daru! Yeah, and of course, Amiya is like, don't touch my doctor, yeah, don't touch my doctor! Yeah, it's gonna be like. No, it's like, like I got lightning powers, baby. Yeah, she's some kind of cursed lady, but uh, yeah, I mean, uh, like tomorrow, yeah, tomorrow, my academia. I felt like I felt like I felt a Deku vibe there. Yeah, don't touch my doctor. Yeah, <laughs> you go away, bastard. Yeah, I got that. Uh, boo indeed, Daisha boo. Yeah, now it's adorable now, yeah, with these little kids. Uh, what are you, Sean? Have you seen my big sister? <laughs> now it's getting adorable. Yeah, have you seen my one <laughs> Yeah, one You gotta say my one yeah. This is the little kids are like, you gotta save our sister. She's the best big sister ever. Man, it's cute and sad, yeah. It's like, it happened to our sister. Yeah, of course we saw the first scene there in the uh, she left it for the opening. Of course, yeah. Don't worry. I will save your big sister. Uni <laughs> yeah. is safe with me. Okay, good. I am Mia is like doesn't know who is that. <laughs> yeah, why is she safe with me? Is that your sister? She told me that before. <laughs> yeah. I like how Mia is amused jump sword. She's like, oh yeah, yeah, I, I can fix that. No problem, kids. It's like that is your sister? Maybe I shouldn't have promised that. Yeah, it's like, wait, wait, I'm just gonna go with this guy. <laughs> it's like, damn it. Didn't think this through. No, she's very determined to do it. Yeah, of course, but like, I think it's kind of cute though. She's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, oh, wait, wait what, did, what did I promise now? Yeah, <laughs> a little bit like that. Wait, why, why did I say that for? Yeah, it's like, oh, shit. They haven't seen too much of this character yet, no? They've been there in the background, right? Yeah, play with her hair. Introduced all their characters, right? Oh, definitely a playful one, yeah. She's like, oh, yada, yada. Uh, she did definitely, uh, she's definitely one of those uh, player. Uh, I guess she's, you know, likes to play around, right? Yeah, definitely. Uh, no, I love she's like, Ugh. yeah. Ugh. <laughs> it's like it sounds like she's like a Viking man, yeah. Ugh. <laughs> yeah so, instead of doing the mushy mushy, <laughs> it's like what? He sounds like it's like a fifty-five year old Viking man, yeah. Ugh. How you doing? Ugh. Yeah, that's what I imagine, man. So like, mushy mushy. Uh, in Sweden, you have to think, yeah, yeah, this is to Sweden, yeah. You say this thing. I do a lot of Swedish, I yeah, answer it like, instead of even saying a letter. Hmm. Also, Nishan is back. Yeah, trying to avoid the... It's obviously living through this like poor... Very nice animation, there's a cool CDI which is running, yeah, I just saw how the... The sides are moving and so on. Yeah, it's pretty nice. The anime is really well done, right? That that was really well done, actually. The running, it wasn't well done, but I mean, the, the 
specifically that running scene actually looks really good. It's very short, of course. Oh, she's probably gonna be captured now. Yeah, she's probably gonna be. Oh, I see. Okay, so I'm just gonna lead after Probis. Yeah, finding Misha or Nishan. Yeah, but I like how Amya was like promised that oh, I'm gonna save your big sister, don't worry. And I was like, yeah, she did it very easily. <laughs> she, well, at least found it very easily, yeah. It, it turned out really well. <laughs> it turned out really well. Well, okay, yeah. Mm, don't worry, girl, we got you. Yeah, it was very easy. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna living up to promise. Hardcore. Oh yeah, I doesn't trust him. It makes sense that I trust them. You're obviously too nice to me. It's obviously a trickery. Yeah, it's obviously a trickery. No, I'm, I'm your friend. It actually makes sense though. She's obviously lived up in this terrible place, right? In the, yeah, the, uh, this abandoned city, right? She obviously is like... Uh, like, why would she trust them, right? Yeah. She, of course, lives up to their... Oh, me, it's always just cursed too, right? Yeah. Just like, yeah, we're the same, I see, yeah. I can, I can relate to your power, yeah, I see. Eps, what I think, is all about trust, right? Who can you trust? Yeah. Who can you trust? Can you trust me? We're on the same side. We met your little kids, right? They're our friends. We saved their life. Yeah. We're good guys, you know. Want to join our good side? <laughs> this feels very like I've played Sukhoda, you know. Sukhoda have 108 playable characters, right? So you have to recruit people all the time. Yeah, if you ever played Sukhoda, you're gonna get new play, you're gonna new, you get a new character every episode, yeah. If they ever make a score and add it'd be the same thing because they need to recruit like at least five people per episode. So, so it's like every episode is like, come on, trust me, I'm your friend now. Yeah, it's like, come on girl, let's be besties, right? Yeah, it's a lot like that. Hontoni! But yeah, 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 I got you girl. It's like, okay. No, I like it, I like it, you know, all about the trust, right? Ka Ishigami. Uh, is that the right person? Oh, she's Petra! Oh my god! Oh yeah, she's Ikumi. Uh, so I'll read the list you're right, you know, uh, her name is Shizuka Ishigami, the voice says uh, Shen, and she's not Ikumi, yeah. I, I, I call her, man, she's a tomboy voice actor, man. Ikumi and Ikumi, from, from, from obviously uh, Food Wars, yeah. So yeah, I still have Pokemon on, guys. So yeah, so I'm gonna come back and play more Pokemon now, guys. So subscribe, and so on. But let's talk about some... Um, but before that, of course, we're talking about this anime. But yeah, this place, right, immediately allowed me a lot of... Oh, maybe Pokemon Top, okay, maybe, sorry. Uh, so immediately, right, this place reminded me a lot of Kovlon, right? Think about that. Uh, if, if it's Hong Kong, right, it's also based on Hong Kong. And this place itself is based on Kovlon, right? So, the, it, it, Kovlon's a very, it's a very, I'd say, I would say, famous city, right? It's like the Forbidden City is basically ruled by the criminal gangs, right, in, in, in previous China, right? and, and now it's destroyed, right? But it used to be just like, basically, a, a, a lawful, you know, territory, right, in China, then, right? We can be like, oh, you can do whatever you want because it was ruled by, you know, the criminal, yeah. And the government is eventually was like, just gonna destroy it, right? Yeah, this went in there and it bulldozed it, right? But for many years, it was like a lawful, kind of like a pirate place, basically, right? Uh, basically, and uh, that's immediately what I'm thinking about. He's saying, Oh, it's Kovlon to go into this guy. It's like, Can we trust this person, right? It's a kind of shine, yeah, it's some kind of like you know, uh, high city in China, but he seems to be somewhat dealing in you know, some bad stuff and so on, right? A lot about trust, right? So, yeah, you know, so this guy's like, Who can you trust, right? You know, he's kind of like dealing with stuff, right? And it also reminds me of a lot of uh, Mild Report, right? In, in Marvel, and Mild Report in Marvel is based, you know, on like Hong Kong, uh, Kovlon, and so on, yeah, it's based on that thing, I'm familiar right? Mild Report is kind of illegal island somewhere, you know, in East Asia, right, in, in Marvel. Also, like, criminal guys and underlords and, you know, Yakuza, whatever, drowning and trials and so on, running the place, right? I love that thing. I mean, I think, as I tell you, I think he's the same race, probably, as Neon, right? You know? She's a kind of, like, mysterious dragon lady, right? Like an Asian dragon lady. I think he's the same thing. He's like a Chinese dragon of sorts. I think he's like a Manticore-ish... Chimera Dragon, whatever, leave a comment below guys, I can't figure it out. <laughs> I can't figure it out, because yeah. Subscribe is a lot about the guys, like, well, Pokemon soon, I can't figure it out, but I think he's like, Neon, probably, yeah. You know, they got the same antlers, right? They got the same antlers, similar color scheme, I think he's also supposed to be that thing. Maybe, yeah, I'm guessing so. Uh, 